Um, Brian, I just came in and I was informed that they can't find Finn anywhere. Should daddy dye his hair blonde? <laughs> what is this day doing to us? Ollie, those shorts are really tight on you. <laughs> We're kind of thinking about getting our house ready Wherever to sell. Good morning. Good morning! And welcome back to our channel. What's up, Make guys? sure you click that subscribe button down below if you mm -hmm. haven't already. Enjoy our family. So, Missy and I went on a little getaway last night. What did we do, babe? We went to a wedding. That's right. It was so fun. We had a blast. It was super fun. It was at a winery. So, we drank lots of wine. We danced <laughs> a lot. It was super fun. And it was cool because it was at a winery. So, we got to stay the night there. And the boys got to stay the night at Mimi and Papa's house. Yes. So, I'm sure they had a blast. And now it's time to go pick them up. So smash that thumbs up button if you guys are excited for today's vlog and to see the boys. I'm excited to hear it all about the fun we had. I know, I'm excited too. We have some big plans today, but first I want to say a huge thank you to everyone who has watched Brian's new lyric oh, video. Oh, that's right. I, my lyric video for my new song, Close To You, is up now. Um, I'll have it linked in the iCard and down below in the description. It's a really fun video. <laughs> We've gotten so much love and support from it, and we just want to say like a huge thank you. Mm -hmm. um, Brian's creating and working on music all the time, and so we're only two songs in. He's already got like more ready, so yeah, be exciting. on the lookout for some new music. It's gonna be awesome. Stay tuned and go check out my new music. But for right now, oh, I see me in the opening. Oh, she's like, voice. hello. Okay, let's go get him. Um, Brian, I just came in and I was informed that they can't find Finn anywhere. Yeah, Finn, Finn. I've looked everywhere. Yeah, Ollie, for sure. Lost Finn? Yeah, but you got you got the air and he was the spare, so we're good. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, Finley, Finley, no, it's, a, it's a royalty joke. All right, Finn, are you hiding from us? Yeah, yeah, come ah, what? That's usually where he hides. That's but, always where um, he hides. I don't, I looked there, he's not there. Oh my gosh, I think he's actually gone. What? Oh my goodness, there he is. He's just playing in the closet with all the toys. I didn't even think he was going to Yeah! You get to go get haircuts! All of our hairs. Very long. Your hair is so long. I know, right? <laughs> just a couple, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna cut it and then I was thinking about going for your color. Oh, yeah. Oh, my goodness. Okay. I totally rock this. It's a, it's Hang a on. Process, oh, like, there's totally a lot of upkeep. Brian's <laughs> not joking. I need, we need to do a poll right now. Oh, yeah. Brian. Vote in the iCard poll. Should I bleach the top of my hair? He wants to bleach his I want to keep blonde. this brown and I want to keep and I want to do like blonde well, just for the summer. Just make it go slow, like light it. I don't want to look like Keith Urban with highlights in my hair. I have been a hard no on this, guys, but I'm also like, whatever, you do it. You well, want. I mean, it's just like hair. hair. Just so. hair. I mean, hair is the <laughs> easiest thing. It's not like he's like, I want to get like tattoos all over my body. I'd yeah. be like, well, uh, can we start with one tiny one? Yeah. All right, so let us know up in the iCard, do you think Brian should uh, dye his hair blonde? Yes, vote in the iCard poll. And Ollie, I have a very important question for you. What? Should daddy dye his hair blonde? So it looks like your hair? Because then it would look like this. Look at <laughs> look at Ollie's hair. I love Ollie's blonde hair. He's got like dirty blonde hair. Yeah. It's so cool. I don't know, what do you guys think? Vote in the iCard poll. Should I dye my hair blonde like Ollie's? I think that'd be so cool. It might be kind of fun. So Missy just dropped Ollie and I off um, to get our haircuts and I grabbed a smoothie. Look at this hair, you guys. You, have you ever seen daddy's hair this long before? Um, yeah. Yeah, it's pretty long though, huh? So we went in to go get our haircuts and Ollie, what did they say? Um, I don't know. <laughs> she asked if we had an appointment and I said yes. And then Travis isn't here. Travis isn't here. The guy who cuts our hair isn't here because apparently he doesn't work today because the appointment is not today. It's next week. Thanks, babe. <laughs> so not only do I have to have this hair for another week, but Missy just dropped us off um, and she went to go get her nails done down the street. So I'm sure she's already started that process. We could sit on that little piece of wood right Yeah, we could totally just sit and chill. I mean, I got my smoothie, which is pretty good. So funny though, because 
Not only did Missy make the appointment a couple days ago for me, but she also drops me off here. And there's no appointment. <laughs> so now Ollie and I are basically stranded. So while well, Brian and Ollie go get their hair cut. Basically stranded. I decided I really need to go fix my nails. I have some broken nails and all that. And so I said I would take Finn, but the little sneaker fell asleep. So now I'm gonna carry him and hopefully he'll sleep while I'm getting my nails done, but I have a feeling he won't. <laughs> so we'll see how this goes. I'm so bummed. I just picked up my sleeping baby, brought him into the salon, and they were too busy. Yeah, so we're back in the car. He's back there still sleeping, which is actually pretty cute. I think I'm just gonna let him sleep because I don't wanna risk waking him up since he seems to be really tired. Um, but I came back because I'm pretty sure I got the dates wrong and Brian and Ollie are supposed to be getting haircuts. I'm so bummed. All right, well, I gotta pick up Brian now and we gotta find something else to do. And now they have long hair for another week. <laughs> uh, sorry guys. Yo, what happened to this day, babe? <laughs> I got the dates wrong. I'm so bummed. I know. I mean, you couldn't even get your nails done. No. Down. I'm sorry. I know, and he, Finn is out. Finn's asleep? Yeah, like he's not waking up. <laughs> what is this day doing to us? I know. Let's go home. Yes. Sorry, Ollie. Were you looking forward to that haircut? really want to get his hair cut. I know, you have crazy hair, bud. Hey guys, so yeah, we just got back from our haircut appointment, or lack thereof, but now we're just back home, hanging out, chilling. Uh, let's go see what the kids are up to. What are you guys doing in here? I'm trying to find out if we could submarine or the boat, but the two pool, I wish we could do both of them. Oh yeah, for the pool? Yeah. yeah. Why do you have your own dog? What do you mean? This is Dada. <laughs> the kids love it when I parent with my uh, Brian doll. To you. It's close, close to you. Yeah, this is uh, the Brian doll from the Close to You lyric video. If you guys haven't seen it yet, go check it out. It's a good one. Yo, Finn, who you got there? Duke Kaboom. Duke Kaboom? And I got Woody from Toy Story. Yeah. Have you guys seen the new Toy Story 4? Let me know in the comments and let me know what you think. Um, we went to the premiere and it was amazing. You guys love the movie, huh? Yeah. We are big Toy Story fans in this house. Right? Boom. Yeah, you like Duke of Boom, I huh? I like Duke of Boom too. Yeah. Okay, so I told the boys you can grab a couple toys and we can go hang out in the pool area. So um, they are going to grab a couple toys and we're going to head out there, okay? Yeah. All right, let's go. Yeah. Ollie, those shorts are really tight on you. <laughs> oh, come on. Why are they so tight on you? Because. Because why? Because it's Finn. You put on Finn swim shorts. <laughs> You're so funny. They are so funny. They can still share clothes because they're both just like little boys. We still have very little boys. <laughs> even though you're gonna be six this summer. Oh my god, I can't even with this. Missy wasn't feeling too good, so I'm gonna let her get some rest time in and keep the boys occupied. Plus, I haven't had a chance to talk with you guys in a while, and I have some things I want to update you on. Daddy, let's see if it floats. I'm gonna do it um, in the pool area. Okay. Because the hot tub is going to like knock it over. Okay, cool. The dogs are feeling, they are loving the pool right now. Wow, our pool is a mess, you guys. Does it float? Oh, it does it. Oh, no. Poor Woody's going to have to find another boat. Yes, it does. Finn just threw his little gecko car in there and it floats. Woo. Good job. Finn's been jumping off the edge and grabbing all of the toys out of the pool for daddy. Like a good little boy. Cleaning up. All right, see if you can get Duke Kaboom. Sometimes he has to jump multiple times to get enough energy. <laughs> I saw him over here though, on this side of the pool. He grabbed the mask and the dive rings right down here and I was like, that's incredible. All right, let's see it. Yes, you got him. Good job. Finn is seriously becoming an amazing swimmer. He is almost pool safe. It's awesome. All right, Finn, we got a little bit of an issue. Huh. Let's go check this out. First issue, bird poop. That's right, bird poop and lots of it. Ew. They like to sit up there and poop. There's so many better places to poop. <laughs> but let me show you the real problem, you guys. We have a real issue, and honestly, a little bit of an update to share with you guys. Okay, this is 
crazy. It hasn't been this bad in so long. <sighs> Look at this field. This is the field in front of our courtyard on our property. It has so many weeds and bushes. I'm pretty sure snakes living in here and lots of bad things. We don't want like coyotes denning in here. So basically we got a ton of rain here in California and rain equals weeds and we got lots of them. So we were supposed to be on the tractor today with Papa clearing this out, but turns out the tractor was broken and it needs a part, so Papa had to run and get a part. But we may just have to get someone in here and clean all this up because we want to get it nice and clean because we're kind of thinking about getting our house ready to sell. We've talked about moving somewhere different, somewhere new. So we've worked really hard on this house for the last three years we've lived here. And we've been loving living in the house, um, but it just feels like maybe we're ready for something different, something new and fresh. Ooh, and just as I say that, new and fresh, I walk out here in my courtyard, these flowers are blooming and they smell so good. You smell that? It's like honeysuckle or lavender, huh? Everything is in bloom right now and beautiful too. So it's like my favorite time of the year to live here. Yeah, don't get me wrong. We love our house, but we just, I don't know, feel like it might be ready for something else. If we do leave, we are gonna have to take this probably. I don't know if we could though. It's got all our names in it and our handprints. We'd have to figure out how to take the flagpole. Hey Finn, do you think we should sell our house? You wanna move somewhere different? Do you wanna get a new house? Oh no. Oh, I think I made him upset. You don't think that'd be fun? Might be. So yeah, we are thinking about selling our house. There are some things we would want to do to it before. Um, we've never gotten around to fixing this fountain, but I'd love to like put a new fountain piece in there. And there was just like a couple of little things that we need to like get cleaned up and make sure it's all set. But this is our home for right now. And the thing that I've learned is that as long as you have good family, like that's your home, you know? My home isn't a physical place or a house. It's just wherever I am with them. And that's what really matters. So trying not to put too much pressure on like a physical object or location because these guys are the only ones that matter. Give me five, bro. Love you. Oh my goodness, Brian just let me sleep and I just took a glorious nap. I never get to nap, guys. I'm usually like super, just feel very busy and I've got kids and stuff. What? Oh, look at all those toys. And you know, as a mom, just napping just doesn't always happen. I'm always like, well, the kids are napping, I'll take a nap. It doesn't happen. I don't know why I always think I'm gonna take a nap. But I just had a great nap. I feel so much better. I was starting to just like drag through my day. But I heard Brian was kind of talking to you guys about how we're thinking about moving. Yeah, it's definitely something, I mean, we have a lot of work to do if we do end up going through with it, but it's definitely pretty high on our possibilities right now. We always have possibilities like having kids, moving, all kinds of random ideas and stuff. This one, you know, it kind of feels like it's moving in that direction. And so we're gonna start like really trying to get the house ready for possibly to sell it, which is so weird. Like I could have never imagined like a year ago selling my house. We love our house, but it's just starting to feel like time to move on something a little more, uh, I don't know what the word is exactly. We have enough room for the kids. I don't necessarily need more room for kids. If I were to have more kids, it might be nice to just have, you know, a bedroom for each kid, even if they, if they were to like share and stuff. I don't know. We're just in a lot of talks about everything and I don't know. What do you guys think? You think we should move? Mimi and Papa are here and they're uh, checking out our big old blackberry bush. That thing is huge now. They started out just little babies. They're little vines, now they're all over. All right, go pick me some blackberries. I can't leave because I have, I forgot my shoes. <laughs> and I can't walk on this. I would get splinters. I don't know about you guys, but I love blackberries. When I was a kid, when we lived in Idaho, and I know there's like, they're in Idaho and probably other places, but they have big bushes off the side of the road and you can just like pick tons of blackberries. I love like blackberry cobbler. I don't think this is gonna make enough for blackberry cobbler, but maybe one day. Dad's going for the hard to reach ones. Ooh, yeah. Like a quarter of a cobbler? Yeah, a quarter. A a quarter. quarter. <laughs> like a I personal need, size. a little bit of blackberry syrup. Mm-hmm. Mm. Here you go, Jimmy. Tell me oh, what you girl. think. Is it washed? Nope. No, those that are the also, best. And also not sprayed. 
<laughs> good, pretty good. Oh yeah, maybe carbon oh, spray them. sprayed them. Okay, well. <laughs> That's natural, right? Brian, we picked some uh, blackberries. No way. Yeah, do you want to try them? Yes, I have chocolate in my mouth <laughs> right now, but. Blackberries and chocolate are the best. Totally. These are blackberries from our bush. From our bush. Homegrown. Yum. Wow. <laughs> pretty good, huh? That is really good. Chocolate. Mmm, chocolate. I always have to have chocolate. I thought I would go into the magic room and go through our little magic door here. If you guys haven't seen, we have a magic door in our house. Hello? What? Hello? Oh! Whoa! It's daddy! What's up? Oh, hey guys. Hey! It's just me, going through the magic door. You kind of scared us. Sorry. <laughs> what? You got sloppy? Make him talk. Thumbs up the video. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> we are learning all about our letters today. Nice. Got to get all those letters in, right, Finn? Mm -hmm. My future oh, no, little guys, astronaut. My name is Sluppy. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Love you, boys. Good night. Good night, Sluppy. Die for. Okay. Bye. Love you. Sweet dreams, okay? Say bye, Sluppy. Die for. Oh my goodness. Hey, Ali. I love you. Have good dreams, okay? Okay. Dream about what we're doing this summer. Do you guys know what we're doing this summer? Don't spoil it. Don't spoil our summer. Leave what you think we're doing in the comments below this summer and we'll reply on those of you who get it right. It's what? hard. Hard. Are you telling secrets now? We gotta be careful in this family, yo. All right, bye guys. Bye. bye.